Hey everyone, Digital David here. Happy Halloween to everybody. We got Jen in the chat. We got little Jumbo in the chat as well. Happy Halloween. Welcome to my New Egg Now live stream today, guys. Really pumped for this stream. Thank you to the folks at New Egg for sending me this monitor to review and promote for you guys tonight. Let me know in the chat, what's your favorite Halloween memory? What do you guys have that you remember as a kid? Or if you still are a, are a kid, where you like to go trick-or-treating, what was your favorite costume, your favorite candy? I'd love to hear from you guys in the chat. Also, if we can get 10 likes on YouTube for our live stream, then I'm gonna unlock a $20 Newegg giveaway, but we gotta then get 10 subs over on Twitch. So if we can get 10 likes on YouTube for the live stream, then we'll turn on a giveaway. If we get 10 subs on Twitch, we'll be giving away a new egg gift card this stream. Happy Halloween. Okay, Brandon, thank you. I, is it not science and tech? I updated it through OBS, but is it not science and technology? All right, I'm gonna do science and tech again. Hopefully we get it up, updated. I put science and tech. What is the what is the category? Is that not it? Hopefully it does it. Hopefully it's not fall, guys. Oh, that's so goofy. All right, well, let me go to Twitch Twitch and we'll uh, we'll change that. Yeah, I changed it right through OBS, but I guess not. Jen, good to see you on YouTube. That's fun. It's been a while. All right. Oh yeah, that's so silly. Fog, that's so silly. How do I edit it here? Darn you, OBS. Thank you for that, guys. Sorry to uh, to mess you up. All right, today in this stream, guys, we are well. We, we will do some Fall Guys, not with Julie, but we'll try out some Fall Guys on the MSI gaming monitor. Thank you, Brandon, for letting me know that. Happy Halloween, Brandon. Thank you for being here. All right. Now it should be done. Darn you, OBS. All right, that should be good. Yeah, thanks Thanks for letting me know, Brandon. Really appreciate it. Brandon, what's your favorite Halloween memory or Halloween candy? Let me know in the chat. Yes, Jen, how's work going tonight? How's, how's, how's the night shift? Brandon's not much of a Halloween person. Brandon, why does that not surprise me? Favorite candy? Are you a candy person? Okay, guys, but while you are answering those questions in the chat, let's go ahead. Let's talk about this monitor right here for a minute. So we have a 30-inch curved gaming monitor from MSI. It's the model number MAG301CR. So 30 inches from corner to corner. It's got a slight curve. I believe it's 1500R for the curve. So just a light and slight bend to it. I really like how it looks. I'll show you it so you can kind of see the curve right there. Pretty, pretty minimal. But we got that wide full HD. So we're actually pushing out 2560 by 1080 for the pixels. One millisecond response time, 200 Hertz. Again, 2560 by 1080. So we got a 21 by nine aspect ratio for this wide full HD monitor. Two HDMI ports, one display port, USB type C as well you can connect to. And we have a built-in USB hub, so I'm gonna use my little USB extension cable here to connect a controller for some console gaming later. AMD FreeSync, and we have some backlit LEDs. So, pretty sweet guys. Currently it's on Newegg right now. Let's go ahead, we can look at the product listing right here. So let's bring it up on screen. That's not the right screen. So let's bring it up on the screen right here so you can see it, MSI Optics. The link is in the chat too, so you can go ahead if you wanna drop the command, exclamation mark, link in the chat. It will take you right to it where you can find out more about it. You'll be looking at the exact same page that I'm looking at right now for the monitor. So currently $329.90 nine cents. So keep that in mind, 330 bucks for a 30 inch wide full HD gaming 
monitor. 100, did I say it's okay? It's 200 hertz refresh rate with DisplayPort or USB, but it says 144 hertz if you're using the HDMI port. So keep that in mind. But one millisecond response time, AMD FreeSync. We have tilt. So you can see, let's go ahead. Well, we can look at some more pictures if you guys want to see some nice pictures of it. And then we'll show you the stand. All right, Brandon says, I like candy. Hard to go wrong with any of it. Yeah, that's true. I'm, I'm in the same boat. So guys, we do actually have, it's a little goofy, I'll show you, but we actually do have portrait and landscape modes, which is nice because this can also be used for video editing, content creation, anything along those lines. Doesn't just have to be for gaming. There's the cool RGB LED along the back. I'll show you it in a minute, live in the studio. So you get a feel for this monitor right here. But yeah, a lot of great specs. Now it isn't 2K, it's not 1440, it's only 1080, but it is wide at 2560. Hello, CBS Sports. Thank you for being here. Happy Halloween to you. How you doing? Let me know in the chat. But you can see this is currently available on New Way, guys. So if you're in the market for an HD widescreen monitor that's curved for gaming because you want 200 hertz, one millisecond response times, then you're going to want to check this monitor out. We'll do some gaming. It does have HDR. It has a night vision mode as well, too. So it's just some software that smartly computes and amplifies details in dark areas of the screen, which could be cool and beneficial depending on what content you're gaming and what games you're playing. So you can find it on Newegg right here. There you go, $329.99 and free shipping. So yeah, pretty sweet guys. Let's go ahead, let's look at it from the main camera again. I wanna show you that stand. So we can't tilt it down any further than what you see right here. And that's the lowest height adjustment we have. But we can raise it up, that's our maximum height right there. Then we can bring it back down. And then you can see we have our tilt right here. That's our max tilt. And then we have a nice pivot rotation, whatever you want to call it. So check it out. You can see how much we can rotate it side to side. Really sweet. Hi, Crystal. Thanks for being here. Crystal, uh, looks like Streamlabs timed you out for a second. Just go ahead. Don't send as many symbols. Look forward to hearing from you and seeing what you have to say. But we got Jen in the chat, CBS Sports, Crystal's here as well. Crystal, yeah, I don't know why it shouldn't have, for your emojis, that should be fine. I think we tweaked it, so I don't know why it, it, it took your comment away. Sorry about that. Feel free just to drop a couple of those in the chat. One or two, let's see if that works. I thought four was safe. Anyways, sorry, Crystal, for that. Overly aggressive moderator. Happy Halloween, Crystal. Happy Halloween, CBS. Jen, Brandon, everybody. Thank you for being here and watching the stream. The link is below if you guys are interested in finding out more about this product. Please go ahead, do your shopping from that link below. So we talked about the stand. You can see the monitor right here. It might be hard to see on the screen, but we do have the Windows 10 display settings pulled up and it's showing us a desktop resolution of 2560 by 1080, 200 hertz. 8-bit RGB, so everything is working properly right there. How's everybody's weekend? How's your Halloween, everybody? So yeah, pretty sweet. Let's go ahead while we have the main cam. Let's look at, you can see the light on the back. So it's gonna look like it's like spinning. That's just my camera. So that's not the case in real life. It's doing what I call like a breath transition and fade between the different colors, but with the lens and how it's picking it up, it looks like it's uh, spinning, but it's not. Let's go ahead, let's look at that. Let's try with the lights off. Hey Alexa, turn off studio lights. Hey Alexa, turn off studio lights. So there you go, you can see. Again, it won't spin. Just ignore the flickering. It doesn't flicker, it just does a smooth, very smooth breath transition between the colors. But I really like it, it's really nice. I, I, I honestly wish they had more RGB LED on the back and along the sides, because unfortunately for my setup, I won't ever see this to appreciate it. 
this will be going against a wall. So, you know, it's not bright enough and I don't game dark enough to be able to um, really appreciate it. So I like this light so much though. I want to see it on the stand. I want to see it all along the sides. You know, I know it might be distracting on the front, but it'd be cool to have it on the front and then you could be able to, um, you know, maybe turn it off or something like that. But I'd love to see it all over. So again, it doesn't spin, it's deceiving. That's just my camera lens with the flicker. It just does a nice breathing, slow breath transition between all the colors. It's really sleek. So again, big fan of the RGB on a monitor. I think it's really cool. I just wish we had more of it and in more visible locations where I could really see it or at least brighter so it could actually project this maybe on your back wall. So if you're like me and this is gaming up against a wall, you'll be able to still appreciate it in some capacity. Hey Alexa, turn on studio lights. But yeah, really cool, really like the light. Then you can see uh, on this side over here, we have our uh, menu button and controls. Yeah, Jen likes it, I like it too. Yeah, Crystal, pretty sweet, isn't it? Um, guys, with your monitors that you have, do you have any uh, backlights? Do you have any RGB LEDs on it? Let me know in the chat. We also have your Kensington security lock right there. All right. So, that's kind of a brief look at it. I I guess we can maybe. Okay, and then in case you're wondering too, so you can see I just adjust it with some fingers, two fingers like that. Um, so you can adjust it. it. It's under its own tension and weight. It will um, be just fine wherever you want to set it, which is cool. Uh, maybe we can do, should I try to show you guys? This might be a fail, but we can try. Might have unplugged it or my computer maybe went to sleep. But here you go, if you wanted to do portrait mode, portrait viewing, so say you have a lot of spreadsheets, something like that, you could do that right here, which is nice. I like this monitor not only for gaming, but for content creation. So to have uh, Adobe Premiere Pro and editing a video on one wide screen as opposed to two individual ones to give us that full timeline stretch is awesome. So I like the size too. I think for most people having a curved widescreen, depending on your desk and setup, if you want to get like a 35 or 49 inch one, you got to have a huge desk in the room. This is nice and compact, but still very vast as well. So now we're going to see, let me go ahead. We'll turn it on its side as I drop the power supply. Let's see if I can show you guys the ports. Oh, something just unplugged. Oh, well, I don't know. We'll find out in a second. Might have to do some tweaking on the stream. But I'll show you guys the ports right here for the camera, or for the monitor, excuse me. So we have our audio, USB Type-C for display. We have our HDMI. These are HDMI 2.0 ports, so we get up to 144 hertz. We have our DisplayPort 1.2 right here. DisplayPort 1.2. Up and you can see the new way gift card, but we have not unlocked that yet. Have we hit 10 likes? I don't think we've hit 10 likes yet on YouTube. I'd have to go look in the stream stats. Maybe somebody, if Jed's watching, can let me know. Once we hit 10, though, we'll turn that on for our Twitch viewers. All right, display port 1.2. Then we got our USB cable right here. So we have our two USB ports. Kind of hard to see with the cables plugged in. Then our USB cable to connect our computer and our power right there. We got a lot of options, pretty cool. All right, now let's go ahead, let's try to bring it back. And it did get unplugged from the wall, so the monitor's not even on right now. So let's go ahead, let's adjust it back. I do wanna point out though, just in my review and experience, I like that we have this option, but I wish it would go a little bit higher to make the transition easier. It's a little goofy how far you have to have it tip. So it does give you both viewing options, but honestly, it's not the most refined. Definitely made to be viewed um, landscape horizontally, but that's fine. Let's go ahead, let's get the monitor plugged back in. All right, we're gonna be back in business. And then we're gonna do some gaming on I'm gonna show you guys, we can look at some YouTube videos if you want to. Just watch some content on here. Let's see if we can get it lined back up. 
And guys, what's exciting is we're gonna be uh, gaming with our, my gaming computer, and we got the 3070 graphics card too. All right. Oops. Is it still plugged in? Can I unplug it again? I might have unplugged something. <laughs> We will see. Trying to get it lined up with that back camera right here. I would go a little wider. All right, what do we got? Do we have display port and everything all set up? Hi, KK. Hi, KK, thanks for being here. Are we plugged in? Probably not. Oh yeah, here we go. All right, let's make sure our computer's awake. We got a controller right here. All right, cool, there we go. So here guys, we're gonna use the USB port right here. In case you're wondering too, you can actually transfer uh, data with this as well. So it is a nice hub. Thank you guys for being here. Hit that like button, follow us. Let's go. Here, let me check the YouTube stream. See how many likes we're at on YouTube. Can we get to 10 likes today? And if so, then we'll unlock the $20 New Way gift card if we get 10 subs on Twitch, which could be hard to do, but we will try. All right. Let's go ahead, let's try to pull up the stream. I'm doing really great, KK. How are you doing today? All right, guys, I just liked it too. So we only got two likes on YouTube. Come on. If we get 10 likes, I'll turn on a new egg giveaway on Twitch or YouTube for that matter. You can enter on either one, but we have to get 10 subs. We got Sean in the chat. Hey, Sean, smash that like button. KK, I'm doing great. I had a great day. Halloween is my mom's birthday, so we celebrated that. And then I have my uh, firstborn Lainey. It's her first Halloween, so she was all dressed up. She looks so cute today. She was Her name's Lainey, so we dress her up as a ladybug. So we call her Ladybug. so that's fun. Um, it's awesome. I can't wait for her to get old enough to trick-or-treat, pass out candy, all that fun stuff. Um, but yeah, uh, great day. Um, what about what about you, though, uh, KK? Did you do anything for Halloween? Sean, did you do anything for Halloween? What's... What's up with everybody's world? What's going on today, this weekend? I'd love to hear from you guys. So Sean, let me know in the chat what you're up to, what you did for Halloween. Same with you, KK. Um, love to hear about what's new. So yeah, guys, also let me go ahead while we're on the platform. Um, let me drop the link. Dropping it on YouTube and we're gonna drop it on Twitch. And you can drop these commands, too, if people are wondering. So, uh, Sean said nothing much. All right. So, where is... Let me pull it up. Should be hiding right here. There it is. All right. So, let me cut to... Our next scene, that's fine. We can look at the new egg listing. Again, if you guys are just joining us, I just dropped the link in the chat. So you can find this monitor, click the link below. It's on the YouTube below in the video description or Twitch and um, YouTube in the chat. Click the link, it'll take you right to this page where you can learn more about this monitor that we're going over and looking at today. You guys are a big fan of the RGB lighting on the back. It's really cool, you can see it right here in the photo. Anyways, go ahead, check it out. So it's 21 by nine aspect ratio, display port, USB type C, HDMI, backlit, wide curved, pretty cool. KK says, I didn't get to go trick or treating because of COVID, but I am glad you're having a great day. Oh, that stinks, KK, I get it. Sometimes it's better to be safe than sorry, but that's not, that's not fun. Sean says, I added my credit card to the monthly Prime subscription on Amazon. That's, that's your night? 
LOL. That's funny. But yeah. Yeah, guys. There's a... Um, I do a lot of Amazon, as you guys know, a lot of Amazon shopping and products, but I also thank to the nice folks at Newegg. We'll be doing a lot more Newegg content on the channel too, which is really sweet. So they were sweet enough to provide me with this monitor today to review for you guys. So any likes, clicks, shares, all that stuff is really awesome. Really helps me continue to provide this content to you guys. Hopefully giving you guys some good insights on this product, help you make great purchasing decisions in the future so yeah so let's go ahead let's bring up the next option right here we're gonna turn off the studio lights again well let me see too um alexa turn off studio lights hey alexa alexa What did I do? Somehow I locked myself out of the brightness. I'm hot mess express right now. Interesting. So Alexa, turn off studio lights. Okay guys, so let's see what you can see. Good, we can look at the menu together. So we have a nice menu here, guys. Also the full video of this monitor dropped on my channel yesterday. So you can check it out there. But we're gonna look at this monitor. We're gonna do some gaming on it. First up, you can see right here, we have our resolution, 200 hertz on Windows. All right, and then I wanna show you in the menu, I don't know why I did something and changed. Yeah, now I can't change the brightness. Maybe it's cause I had it in the wrong one, auto. That's silly. I don't know what happened. You can change the brightness. Oh, that's why. There we go. I had it in a different mode right there. So there we go. We got max brightness too. So the monitor's bright enough. No issues there. Didn't notice anything like that. Very happy with it. Oh, let's do this. I had somebody on Twitter ask after they watched the video um, about like backlight bleeding. So let's go ahead, let's get a black screen up here and I'll try to show you guys what I noticed. But honestly, it's so hard to tell. So here's a black screen. Obviously there's no defective pixels. It's gonna be really hard for you to see on the screen right now yourself. Um, but when I look at it, if you're worried or anxious about any sort of like IPS backlight bleeding or the IPS glow. Um, in this case, when I really look at it, when the lights are off, um, I need to get the room completely dark. I, I might see a smidge right here, almost like right where it, it, it like curves. But, if, but then it also, sometimes it changes depending on your viewing angle. So if you're dead set on, maybe a smidge down here, but no, I would, depending on how picky you are, I would say no, um, not really any, not bad at all. Maybe a smidge in that corner, but no, I think overall fine. Again, maybe if you're really picky to it, I'm sorry if you land on this monitor and you're not happy with it, I guess you can get mad at me, but tell me that in the chat. For me personally, no, it's fine. At the angle, maybe, but that might just be more of it's a curved display than anything like glaring issues for it. But if you only game in the dark, 
all the time with a lot of dark screens. Well, maybe you'll see more flaws better than I can, but um, no, I think it's fine in case you're wondering. But I love to hear from you guys. Always reach out. Let me know. I want to talk monitors with you guys. I want to go through everything. No dead pixels, nothing like that. Um, great response times too. We can do that test. Um, I always call it alien. It's UFO test. But let's look at that. You'll We'll see it right now. We can look at the refresh rate. So we're dropping almost 200 FPS. So I probably, uh, don't, just ignore that for now. We can refresh it one more time. We'll see if it works. Sometimes it gets goofy. With the browser, but that's fine. It, always, it doesn't like the browser sometimes for some reason, but um, it's funny. There's no stutter on my screen. I can tell a difference between, I mean, for sure 50 and 200, but I feel like if I'm really looking at it, I can even tell a difference between 100 and 200 with this monitor. So it is really nice. Um, let's see if I can show you guys. I, I was, when I do this test, I was looking into the anti-motion blur. So we can turn that on too. Sometimes I think it helps. Then other times I'm looking at it and I'm like, well, does it? So in this case, like when I'm looking at it again, I'm like, if I look off to the side for sure, huge difference from the bottom to the top. The top looks flawless compared to like a million different aliens at the bottom. And then don't worry about the stuttering you're seeing on the screen. That's just the camera and the monitor not playing along. You're not seeing that in real time. But when I turn that on, just pay attention to what has happened. And you know that on the back end, there's software that's, um, you know, trying to tweak the motion blurring for you and the frames. So when I look, I feel like I still see some tearing with the alien. So maybe it makes it a little bit worse in this case. I thought before when I did it, it actually made it look better. But let me turn it off again and we'll see. In a weird way, I swear when I have it on, the alien at the 200 FPS looks clearer but there's a huge trail of other aliens behind him still. Where now with it off, he looks clear, but not as clear, but there's no aliens behind him trailing. So just keep that in mind. Hi, Jake. Hi, Jake. Thanks for being here. Happy Halloween to you, Jake. What's new? How's your day? How's your Halloween? Let me know. We're going over this awesome MSI Curve gaming monitor right now. We'll be live for another half an hour going over it. We're going to be doing some gaming now to show you guys real test footage of it. But you can see right here just the difference between 50 FPS, 100, and 200. This is a 200 hertz monitor. So we can get those 200 FPS with nice, smooth footage. My day was great. Did you do anything for Halloween, Jake? Did you do anything for Halloween? Thanks for stopping by and saying hi in the chat. I need you guys to hit the like button too. Smash that like button. Give us a follow, subscribe, all those goodies. So yeah, guys, you can see that test. Where's my mouse? There it is. We can go black screen for it. Maybe that helps you see it a little differently. Let's turn the motion Blur, anti-motion blur on again. Yeah, so I almost feel like there's more stutter with it on. Which wasn't the case, I swear, the first time I looked at it. Because he looks, he looks clearer. Yes, you ate a lot of candy, though. So yeah, guys, you can see that. Let's go ahead. Let's go back out. Now we can do, do you guys want to do, Alexa, turn on studio lights. 
We can load a game. Hey, Alexa, turn on studio lights. We can do some gaming if you want. So let's go ahead. Let me get some gaming pulled up. What do you guys want to see? Some Fortnite first? I was, I've been doing Fortnite on like normal settings. We can push the 200. Ooh, let me fire up MSI Afterburner. We'll look at the frame rates and everything too. Jake, what was the favorite piece of candy you got and ate today? So we're working on launching Fortnite. And guys, the full review of this dropped on my channel. So be sure to check it out if you're interested, but we're going over everything today on the stream too. We just gotta wait for the game to load. It's being slow. That's what happens when you game in real time. All right, I also will have to turn on, I have not swapped over my new computer yet. So I need to change my streaming setup so we can capture this properly. Um, just haven't done it yet. So soon I will do a stream where we will install the Elgato capture card in my desktop, which will be sweet. All right, there we go. Great, Fortnite is upon us. We can switch back. Jolly Ranchers, good choice, love Jolly Ranchers. Here we go, we got Fortnite right here. And then somebody else asked in the video, um, not that I'm aware of, you can see it's doing the, the correct resolution for us, but if you're watching like a YouTube video, um, at, you know, 2K or 4K, you're going to have bars along the side. I can show you that when we're done gaming if you guys want to see. Um, that's just going to be with any ultra-wide monitor that I'm aware of. You'll have those issues. So typically I play with keyboard and mouse, but for the stream we'll be doing a controller. Let me show you guys the settings we're going to do. I think if we do medium, we'll be able to. I've been fine with VSync off. So we'll do medium for now. We'll try to fill a match and then I'll turn on some of the game audio. But let me know in the chat, can you hear me twice and does it sound bad? Because I kind of got to use another microphone to record the game audio. Okay, good, because I'm recording it through a microphone right now. So I want to make sure it's not too loud or anything, so I'll defer to you guys. Thanks. Crystal said yes. Jake says I sound good. Sean says audio's good. Ooh, that seems so loud. I might tweak it. I'm dropping by. Uh, 
All right, we'll drop down. Alexa, turn off studio lights. Do you guys want the lights on or off? Do you like it better off or on for the, seeing the monitor? Let me know, we can do some of both. If you want lights on or off. Look at that, perfect free fall. All right, we should be. We should be able to push more frames. We're using the 3070. There, we're at 200 FPS. So you can see that guys, we're getting 200 FPS right now. Thanks Jake, appreciate you being here. Always stop by and say hi. I hear it. Hi, 409 Andrew. Hi, Andrew. Thanks for being here. How's your Halloween? Happy Halloween. He's not going to wait for me. What's going on, Andrew? What do you guys think about the 200 FPS we're getting?
All right, we're gonna we're gonna not make it. All right, guys, we're testing out the MSI Optics MAG three zero one CR thirty inch curved gaming monitor. Fortnite medium settings. We're getting two hundred FPS. Let me know what you guys want to see in the chat. Got him. Oh, man. Thanks, Sean. That was a good one, but and I stunk. Hello, Liddy Tex. man. Hello, happy Halloween to you too, Liddy Tex. Sean, this is for you trying to Let's go. Oh, man. Too far. Guys, look at the FPS. We dropped down some. We're averaging 172. Got him. Oh, no way. What's new, everybody? Liddy Tex, if you're still there, how's your Halloween? Thank you. 
Got him. Let me know what you guys think about the quality of this monitor in gaming. Got him. Got him. Oh man, it's a massacre. Again, medium settings. I try to do the up close sniper shoddy. Got him. Oh man, it's so hard to see everybody. Yeah, Sean, I'm impressed. Obviously you can push out more or less depending on like what you're using. Got him. This has been a good match.
Jeez. Alexa, turn on studio lights. We can do some with the lights on too. Oh, we got second. Oh man. All right, what do you think? You guys see enough Fortnite for now? Do you want to do a different game? Sure, let's do a different one, David. Let's do some Fall Guys. What about some Fall Guys for her all time's sake? All right, let's get out of here. Let's pull up Fall Guys. What do we need? Steam. All right, let's go. Got to end the stream with some Fall Guys gameplay. What else do you want to see with this monitor? Fire away in the questions in the chat. I'm at, happy to answer any and all of them. Love to hear from you guys, so please don't hesitate to reach out. So let's do it. We're gonna push 200 FPS. All right, guys, we're going to load a game. Let's go. Let's see if we can get a crown for the stream. All right, guys, we're going to do some Fall Guys, and then we're going to be done with the stream for the night. So stick around for the next couple of minutes. Let's have some fun. All right, I gotta do. Uh... Yes. There we go. We get the frame rate counter up on the screen again.
Now we're going to spectate. No, great question. New eggs legit. New eggs awesome. Anything in particular you're looking for, CBS Sports from New Egg? No, New Egg's great. Tons of awesome content. I buy a lot of computers and tech stuff from New Egg, but they cover a wide variety and range of products. Who's going to make it? Ah, oh, boo-hoo. Good question, though, CBS. Thanks for being here. Let's chat about whatever you want. What do you guys think about the monitor? Look. For gaming. Night Fever. Crystal's still here. Thank you. Thanks for the support in the chat, guys. I really appreciate it. Thanks for being here. Hit that like button. Reach out to any questions, comments, concerns about this monitor. What do you want to see? Try to cover everything tonight for you guys. Let's go. All right, that's what we're talking about. All right, we're spectating. Who else is going to make it? Two left. Oh, so sad for them. This one's crazy, guys.
Reach out in the chat. Let's go. Yes. Oh, gosh. through guys giving you a good show what do we think it's slime climb oh seven we go right to jump showdown oh fall mountain okay for the crown come on Wish me luck, guys. It's the monitor. We got the crown! Bam! Look at that, guys. Won the crown on stream. GG's, everybody. Let's go. How awesome. We got the crown. All because of the MSI monitor. Who would have thought? Flawless. Amazing. Only because of this monitor, so you definitely need to buy it. How sweet. Look at that, we got the crown, we got the crown. So awesome guys, pretty sweet, right? I'm very happy with that. Definitely helps to have the good performing monitors to up your game. So let's go ahead, let's exit out. That was nice. Easy peasy tonight with that. So yeah, pretty cool. What'd you guys think about that? Nice monitor, let's go ahead, let's go over the listing again in case you're just joining us. And we're gonna wrap up the stream, but we'll just leave the windows display up on it right now. So yeah, guys, we looked at Bradley. Did you see that? Crown him with many crowns, baby. How good was that? What's so funny is when I try to play Fall Guys with like my sister on stream and we try to win crowns, I can't. When I'm reviewing a monitor casually, guess what? I win a crown. So so awesome, glad you were there. Hopefully you saw it. If not, go back a minute in the stream. Yes, yes, Postal Reaper saw it, GG's. Liddy Tex is still in the chat. I didn't see Liddy Tex earlier answer my question about their Halloween, but um, thank you for being here. We got Bradley in the chat too, guys. So we just won a crown with our MSI 30 inch curved gaming monitor. The full review is on my YouTube channel. Go ahead, check it out. If you're on uh, YouTube, or Twitch in the chat, just do exclamation mark and link and it will take you to the link that you can use to check this out on Newegg. So I'll go ahead, I'll drop it, but you guys could do it in the chat yourself if you want. Crown him with many crowns, I love that. A little inside joke there. So cool. So fun guys. All right, so really quick before we wrap up the stream, and happy Halloween to everybody that's just joining us. 
Yes. How good was that crown on our gaming monitor? See, that's my issue. I just didn't win any crowns because I didn't have a good gaming monitor. That's the issue why. Oh no, Crystal, it took your emotes away. I don't know why. I, I, gotta, I gotta change that. It must be on Twitch I changed it and not um, on YouTube. I'm so sorry, Crystal. It's too uh, extreme tonight. It thinks it's spam, but it's not. Crystal's not spamming us at all. So sorry that I need to change that in the settings, but thank you for the crowns and your support. Awesome, awesome. Yes. Okay. Lady Texas Halloween was good. Thanks for asking. You're welcome. Thanks for being here. Thanks for the crowns, guys. Yeah, drop a crown in the chat, please, and thank you. It was so fun. So really quick, guys, we're going to go over the monitor one more time for you all if you're just joining us. You can see it on Newegg right here. The nice folks at Newegg sent me this monitor to review for you guys. So check out the video on my channel. Like, comment, share it. Click the link below, please, and thank you. And do your shopping from there as well. And be sure to price shop because Newegg has a lot of great prices on their products. So this is the monitor we reviewed today. Won our crown on. 330 bucks out the door, free shipping. You're all set and ready to go. Wide full HD, 2560 by 1080. 200 hertz refresh rate with display port or USB type C. 144 hertz with HDMI 2.0 in here. One millisecond response time. And it does have USB type A, two of them, 3.2 adapters. You could transfer data, charge your phone, that sort of thing. Tilt, swivel, height adjustable stand, 21 by 9. Happy Halloween, Candy. Happy Halloween, Candy. Thank you guys for being here. So fun. Thanks to Newegg again for sending me this product. Stay tuned, guys. Oops, I don't know why the gift card thing is up. Sorry about that. We did not make it to that tonight. Whoopsies. There we go. And it's off again. Sorry. Uh, but anyways... Excellent, Sean, yes, so glad you guys are here. Anyways, thank you so much for being here. Stay tuned for more upcoming streams and more Newegg Now content. So right now my schedule is once a week, I'll do a dedicated Newegg Now on-demand video and then I'll follow that video up with my live stream on that product. So in the future, be sure to catch that video on my YouTube channel. Obviously reach out with any questions, comments, concerns there or contact me on social media. Or hold on to that question and stay tuned for the live stream and then reach out and we'll go over it together. How about that, right? You can get real time, um, honest answers from me, reviews, that sort of thing. I would love to have you guys be a part of that. Stay tuned soon for some more giveaways. We didn't hit enough likes tonight on YouTube to unlock the $20 New Way giveaway, but maybe we can do that in a future stream. So thank you guys for being here. Click that link below. Happy Halloween to everybody. Really appreciate you guys being here for your likes your comments, your support, follows, shares, everything like that. It means the world to me as I continue to try to build and grow up my brand and channel. I want Newegg to keep working with me so I can keep providing these videos for you guys free of charge. So anyways, would love to have better engagement. So share it with all your friends, family members, and have a great, great, great rest of of your evening guys thank you for being here and stay tuned for our next new egg now episode it will be this coming wednesday this wednesday at 10 a.m eastern time we're going to be having our um, new monitor uploaded on our youtube channel and it's another msi monitor so we got the msi it's a 30 32 inch um curved gaming monitor that's pretty sweet as well so you'll see a similar stream like this format but i'm open to suggestions any feedback what you guys want to see in the future so let me know thank you guys so much for watching and i will catch you in the next stream